What is ceiling construction excellence? Well, it's building faster, easier, and better while not sacrificing quality or original design intent. These three curved drywall grid scenarios demonstrate ceiling construction excellence using Armstrong Drywall Grid. Armstrong will customize shop drawings for your specific job complete with radius coordinates so you can easily plot out your jig templates on the job site. RC2 clips make holding concave or convex shapes very easy. Instead of forming and bending cam angle at the wall, let's just screw a shaped drywall grid main runner to the wall, then just stab our perimeter cross tees in. A 5 8 inch drywall spacer tucked behind the main runner, keep it upright while screw attaching to the wall. Notice how our first main runner is spaced four feet off the wall, ready to accept a four foot cross tee. The second main runner is six feet away, ready to accept our six foot cross tees. If it's only a single layer of 5 8 inch drywall, six foot cross tees will eliminate one third of your mains and one third of your hanger wires. Remember that faster, easier, better thing? We are going to kick back to structure every four feet, that one long side, then return to the wall with a 90 degree pocket. These 90 degree bent pieces can be spaced as far as four feet apart, which means less bending in time for you. If any of the vertical or horizontal runs of your pocket are greater than 24 inches, then just stab a 48 inch cross tee perpendicular to your bent tees and space those 48 inch tees on 24 inch centers. Ready for another scenario? This conventional barrel vault will be built with six foot cross tees while incorporating an unconventional pyramid shaped pocket. Bent main runners mounted to your starting wall make stabbing in your first row of tees easy. Screw attach every second or third cross tee to the wall main. The secure lock splice securely splices one main to another. Watch how easily these six foot cross tees stab into place from five feet away. Switch to the XL8965 six foot cross tee and immediately eliminate one third of your main runners and hanger wires on your next project. Now comes the pyramid shaped pocket return, which is easily preformed on a jig with our DW90 clips. We are installing the bent pocket sections six feet apart with six foot perpendicular cross tees. Now, if this isn't faster, easier, and better, I don't know what is. Now you asked for creative, so here it is. This installation team decided to shape their framing to resemble an inverted open book. Going old school, they expertly calculated and plotted the radius jig points themselves. Give Armstrong two weeks and we will do the shop drawings for you. Sandwiching a flexible cut main runner between two pieces of 5 8 inch drywall makes a great job site jig or template. Faceted drywall main runners come pre-cut every 8 or 16 inches depending on your radius. If necessary, you can always cut a standard drywall grid main runner yourself every 8 or 16 inches. Now, we're back to the same process as the last two installations. Just hang your mains six feet apart and stab in your six foot cross tees. Unless, of course, you want to use more material or if you're carrying a load greater than one layer of 5 8 inch drywall. If so, 
Use a four foot or even three foot cross tee. Your Armstrong installation specialist can help you determine which tee best fits your load requirements.